Okay, this is an explanation of case one, where you're supposed to open the file league, which I have on my uh, on my screen, and you're supposed to save it. as league form letter. And I'm going to save mine in my additional cases folder that I have on my desktop. Okay, so instruction number two locate an online photo to insert so go to insert uh, online pictures and the topic is baseball And you can pick any of them. I'm just going to pick that one. And then it tells me it should be only one inch in height. And when I do that, it adjusts both of them. Uh, it also should be uh, square text wrapping. And it should be centered between the left and the right margin. So about there. Okay, it doesn't have to be exact. Um, change the document theme. So I go to design themes and we want the theme to be frame. Select any paragraph and change the font size to 12. I'm going to select the first paragraph change the font size to 12, change the line spacing to single, and then change the normal to update all the selections so it changes all the paragraphs. Remove the space after the first two paragraphs, which would be these two. So make that zero. Center the four paragraphs from uh, Thursday through doors open. Remove the space after Christy Lamoli. And change that to your name. Replace the date placeholder with the current date. So we go up here. And we want to insert the current date, so it would be insert the date, and we want it uh, 18 November 2016. Okay, and then begin a mail merge using league form letters. So I'm going to go to mailings. I'm going to start a mail merge using these letters. Then I go to start and I use an existing list and I go to my additional cases folder.
Okay, so I go to my additional cases folder and I want to get uh, the coaches. Okay, and then it tells me to replace the remaining highlighted text with merge field codes from the coaches data source. So use the format for the address block, which is your inside address. I'm going to use for the address block, uh, they want Joshua Randall Jr. So click OK. And for the greeting line, they want Dear Josh what dear Joshua comma and I need to take those brackets out of there I also do not want these highlighted, so I'm going to take that out. Okay, and then here I need to uh, replace the brackets with a uh, team name. And I go up to mailings, insert a merge field, and it's the last one. Be sure there's a space after it and before it, and I don't, again, I don't need the highlighting. And all the team name, team members, okay. And save the document. Okay, preview the merge, so I go to mailings. And I preview the results, and that should show me only one of them, so I can see how it looks. And it looks what they asked us to do, and there could be some corrections here to make it look better. Like right here, this all could be no spaces after so it wouldn't look so separated little add a little space between the date and that's the proper letter format but i'm not really checking the letter format and we definitely don't want it to go to two pages so i'm gonna move that up a little bit So that's a good example. Be sure it doesn't go to two pages. So we mail merged one of them and looked at it. So now we can finish the merge, edit individual documents, and click OK. And then they want that one saved as Coach Banquet Letters. And that is the first part of Case 1. Notice at the bottom that you should have 11 letters, page 1 of 11. So it's not just the one letter, but it's all of them merged together. Be sure that you check that. So I'm going to close that. I'm going to close this one. If you put it all in the additional folders, you create a folder or additional cases folder, then it'll all be there for you and you won't need to worry about what you need to turn in because you can turn in the whole folder. Okay, that finishes instruction 10. So instruction 11, I'm going to start a new video. So let's stop there with instruction 10.